Hi boys and girls, it's Miss DJ. In today's video, I'll be showing you a sensory activity that you can do at home with your parents. The activity that I'll be doing is called a squeezy sensory bag. So the items you will need for the sensory bag will be flour, food coloring of any color, a cup of water, a bowl, a measuring cup, and also a spoon to mix it all together. So the first thing you will do is you will need one cup of flour. So Miss DJ is going to get a measuring cup right here. One cup of flour, and you pour inside the bowl. So that's one cup of, water, of flour. So it's gonna look like this. It's gonna look like more, but I'm just gonna use a little bit. Okay. Next, you will need six tablespoons of water. So a spoon, a cup of water. One, two. Three, four, five, six. Miss DJ is going to add more flour. Okay. And then once you add the more flour and full coloring, so Miss DJ is going to use green. You can do five or six drops. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. So it should look like this with the food coloring. Then you're gonna mix it. Mix it all up. So when you mix it, it should look like this. And you can add more, more food coloring if you would like. Okay. Add some more water. Okay. And then you're going to mix it. And mix it until it gets so smooth. And you're able to keep this out if you would like. So. It should look like this. And next, you would, you would need to, once you really stir it, get a sandwich bag. Pour it in a sandwich bag. And once you pour it, it should look like, so this is the one I made. It should look like something just like this. And you're able to fill, you're able to could write your name with it and make sure it's closed so nothing leaks out so that's the one i did this is the orange one so miss d is going to put the green one in the bag and what you do is you hold the bag like this and you pour it in the bag get some more and pour it in a bag. And if you don't want your hands to get messy, you can wear gloves if you like. And then once you get all of it, you will zip off the bag. You see, you didn't do a lot on this one. Make sure you zip lock it and lock it. And then once you do that, you're able to play with it. Make sure all the air is out the bag. And then there you go. And once it's done, it will look like this. And then you're able to play with it to see how it feels. 
And you can even put different stuff in there. You can put beads, rice, whatever you like, so you can be able to fill it. Can't wait to see a video and pictures. I hope you enjoy. Bye.